it's the crypto lightsaber back with another video guys we're going to talk about splassive i just wanted to do an update on the price of splassive because it does appear to be pumping um i did talk about splassive yesterday and um i said it would be nice if we got a breakout let's just uh let's just change the chart to the one day chart uh, might as well do it like that so we can see what's going on so we can see this breakout i did expect a potential breakout outside of this level and i'm not sure what's actually causing it to pump i think there might be a buying competition or something like that if we go into the splash of telegram um uh, i know they've got this beta testing thing going on and they've got the roulette i saw this announcement earlier um let's just have a look uh, weekly development news splash kings updates we're adding more quests which means you get more splashes and waves um i hear that wave is pumping also uh, let's just have a look at the wave chart so obviously wave is the br34p type token for the uh splassive uh you know the splassive dap uh, it does look like wave is also still moving to the upside so pretty good um I'm really happy about this because obviously, you know, for some of us have held out for a long time in Splassive and it looked like it was just dying off and now we are seeing some signs of life. So it is up to uh, 42 cents, just under 43 cents. If we have a look at my account, because I did tell you I did do, uh, I did get a max account. So I have this max account. As you can see, my max payout is 100,000 Splash, um, 27,801 point nine nine splash which is now eleven thousand nine hundred and thirty one dollars so that's approximately uh two hundred and forty dollars a day and then i have a second account which i've been building i've just been airdropping uh, uh to to this second account so i've not been selling the splash i'm just sending it over here six thousand eight hundred and seventy three uh splash approximately fifty dollars a day sixty dollars a day at the time of recording this video so between both accounts we're looking at uh, approximately uh, what was it we're looking about approximately three hundred dollars a day on splash so uh yeah pretty happy about that uh, price is moving um, we have the games coming out we have the roulette coming out um, we have a lot of hype in the telegram group everyone's posting charts everyone's excited um i know that a few people in my telegram group have got numerous accounts as well so uh yeah it's looking pretty bullish guys just wanted to give you that quick update um i did talk about this before um when we covered uh you know stunner breezy and his strategy on drip when everybody was giving up on drip uh, he was continuing to buy it while the prices were down uh, we got a video from crypto vol down the DeFi rabbit hole as well which i'm going to watch in a little while um but yeah, just continuing to buy, continuing to uh, DCA, um, build up a max account while the prices are low. Uh, just take it advantage. It looks like the price may have jumped a little bit more. Let's just have another look. Uh, yeah, almost 44 cents. For some reason, this thing is just pumping like crazy. And um, I think it's up about 130, 140% since the other day. Uh, it was down all the way down to about 13 cents. Now it's all the way up to 43 cents. So a little more than uh, 140% actually. Um, <clears throat> well, I think over the last 24 hours, up about 135%. But right now we're looking at, you know, pretty decent splash, uh, splashive chart. So uh, yeah, I just wanted to give you a quick update. Um, you know, you got to stay stay true to what you believe. Um, you know, uh, just, just continue with your own strategy. A lot of people will FUD and... You know, they'll, they'll have their own ideas of what the market's going to do, of what they think is a good project and so on. But, um, yeah, I'm pretty happy with the price of Splash right now. Um, I would like to build uh, another few accounts, but as the price is moving, um, I'm just going to continue to airdrop uh, from this account to the other account. And, um, you know, if this goes to the moon, obviously, uh, what I'll do is I'll just start to take some profits, scale out some profits bit by bit. Uh, because obviously we don't want to harm the price they've got the anti kind of the the anti-dump mechanics right um we can only claim uh once every claim or compound once every 24 hours or something like that and um 
yeah, obviously, if you do hit a max account, your your payout rate is going to stay at two percent. If you have an account where your claim it's not a max account, you're claiming more than your compounding, uh, your percentages may decrease as well. All right, guys. In fact, it does kind of mention it here. Let's just zoom out a little bit. So it says to better sustain the project, we've decided to change a few things about the tap. We don't think that abusive taxes on sales is the way to go. This is why we decided to work on the rewards. We want to give good players more rewards than bad players. People can still get the 2% by claiming one day and compounding the other day. Here are the changes we are adding to the tap. So when you claim, it decreases the reward rate by 0.25%. When you roll, it increases the rate by 0.25%, max 2%. When you deposit, it doesn't change anything to the current rate. Uh, the 24-48 hour time of restart see below you can claim or roll once every 24 hours you can only have the max 48 hours of rewards after 48 hours your reward doesn't add up you need to claim or compound it you won't get any reward until you've done those actions but when you hit the max wallet 27,777.78 splash the rate will be fixed at two percent so i don't need to worry about this account uh, of course the only thing i can do is claim but uh like i said i'm just claiming airdropping over to my second account and and i have been buying a little bit as well so before you know it i'll have another max account uh, potentially uh, but if the price does continue to moon of course you know i think the best thing to do will be to obviously lock in some profits as well because you know um you've always got to realize some profits uh, in my opinion okay and um, everyone can stick to their own strategy some people just compound till the sun goes down but you know i like to lock in some profits as well but uh, it's just about being responsible, to be honest, um, and not trying to hurt the protocol, not trying to hurt the project. And um, I did say in my last video, you know, I could see a potential 10x. Um, it won't be far for us to get to that. I think from here, it would be probably another 3 to 4x to reach that 10x mark, which I talked about the other day. So, uh, you know, someone said that I was a dreamer for thinking that, but um, it doesn't look like... Uh, it will take us too long to get there by now. Okay, it was about 16 cents. So a 10x from 16 cents would have been about a dollar 60, 43 cents, 40, 80, 120. Yeah, so another 4x from here, we would reach that 10x from 16 cents, uh, I believe. All right, guys, so let me know what you think in the comments. Splashing, bullish or bearish. Let me know what you think in the comments, guys. I think we're going to see more upside. I think we're going to see... Uh, 1 million plus market cap and that is just being conservative um let me know what you think and i'll see you guys in the very next video okay.